If you're a heating air conditioning technician or even a salesperson, why does the way that you ask for money matter? And why is this important? This is a super important question. I'm Scott Savon Bell. I'm coming to you live from Honolulu, Oahu on a perfect day to talk about sales and a perfect day to talk about you. All right, so this week I uh, jump on a sales call for a person who's trying to sell me some goods, right? I'm a consumer too, I buy stuff, but when I buy stuff, I take notes and I'm like, what example can I give a salesperson or an entrepreneur of things to do or not to do? So I'm gonna teach you something to not do. Talking to this guy and he's like, he's, he sells goods and services, I'm gonna leave the industry out. And he gives me an example of how he does his fulfillment. And I said, hey, <clears throat> on some of these websites where you just explained, you're going against the terms of service. What happens if you have a client that's got an issue? And he he gives me a word that, like my stomach just goes, whoop, 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 something's wrong here. And he goes, I've, I've never had a problem. We never have a problem. And he kept using the word never. And I'm like, you know, that's an absolute qualifier, my friend. When you say the word never, you're telling me that there's never been an instance. And in this industry, like I've, I've been in the market for this thing that I'm after and I've talked to about six different people because there's something very specific I'm looking for and all the other five people have told me, hey Scott, you know, here's the thing. You have to be aware of one, two, three, X, Y, Z because if you do this wrong, you're going to end up with issues with this, this group of people. And I said, hey, thanks for letting me know that. So I wasn't looking for red flags. You know, in most presentations, I'm like, okay, I'm in green flag mode. I really want to do this business. I really want to get this thing done. And then I went to yellow. I went from green to yellow. And I'm like, okay, green to yellow. That's okay. Yellow just means caution. I just need to do some more investigation. So then the guy tells me, he goes, okay, so here's how you're going to pay. Now, if you don't know that like uh, consumer credit cards, when you make a purchase, like things through PayPal, and you say, hey, I'm going to send that money as a friend or as a personal, you don't have the same protections as business. And there's also a different charge. So I said, in what way? would I compensate you for what needs to be done? And he says, you're gonna use this platform and you're gonna choose personal. And I went, ugh, like, ugh. How you ask for money matters. He asked me the wrong way for money, right? He went down the path of saying, hey, I am gonna get all the benefit of you using a personal account, but you are gonna take on all the risk even though you're a business. So I said, hey, look, <laughs> I can't do that. I've got an LLC and my accountant takes a look at all my stuff. And the second he's like, this is a personal account. It goes against all my rules that I have in place for what needs to go on. And so like he kind of hemmed and hawed and said, hey, but I really want to do this deal with you. And I'm like, look, I get it. Like, this is like, I'm not saying I got to think about it because like, I'm not going to think about it. Like I really need to put this in my gut and do a gut check because right now I'm not vibing with this decision. So I said, I need two hours. I need two hours. So I sat down and I mapped this out. And ultimately, at the end of the day, I decided to not do business with this individual or his company. And this is why you should join my, my email list. So I'll give you the goods, not in the Facebook group, not in the YouTube channel. And what that means for you is extra private coaching and training or group coaching and group training at a discounted rate. So how you make your offer matters. And when you're talking about money, everybody's guard is up. My guard is up. Your client's guard is up. And if you start giving fake information, chances are good you may actually lose that deal that you worked your butt off to get so you really need to rehearse the tough questions that you're gonna ask now if this guy would have said hey look here's the cost if we do it via one way here's the cost if we do it another because at the end of the day the guy was trying to cut down on his cost of credit card processing which I completely understand but if he would have said hey if you want to do it that way there's gonna be an additional cost and I would have been like great I get it but it was shenanigans and I had to call him out on shenanigans so be aware, when you talk about money, how you talk about the money matters to the people that you're dealing with. You got one of three things to do from here, just one of three. Find the subscribe button, click on it every time I send out a video, you'll get an update. Or hit follow if this is social media. And last on this list is share this video with a friend, tag it to them, send it to them. They're going to love you for it. They're going to be like, I love that Scott Silvan Bell dude. So do I. <laughs> we'll see you soon. Aloha and mahalo.